LDC modules have four components. What task, what skills, what instruction, and what results. The module provides a blueprint for integrating content and the Common Core in a two to three week instructional plan, which engages students in reading, research, dialogue, and writing about important topics and issues. This video is designed to assist teachers in developing the What Instruction section of an LDC module. Building an LDC module begins with the task. However, it is the instruction the teacher provides that makes all the difference in student success. In an LDC module, teachers use the skills list to plan a series of mini-tasks. Many tasks are small, scorable assignments that teachers use to address the identified skills. Together, the skills list and many tasks form an instructional ladder. It's the plan for helping students complete the tasks and makes up the What Instruction section of an LDC module. Let's take a closer look at the instructional ladder. Start with the skills list. The skills list identifies the skills that need to be taught. These skills are an outgrowth of the Common Core standards hardwired into the task. Design a mini-task for each skill. In other words, plan short assignments or lessons to engage students in developing the skills they need to complete the task. Add instructional strategies and pacing. Outline what you will do and about how much time is needed to do it. After you have created your task and identified the skills students need to be able to complete the task, you are ready to create your own mini-tasks. Let's examine some mini-tasks together. Teachers might use different templates or organize mini-tasks differently, but all mini-tasks share the same common elements. Prompt, Product, Scoring. After determining the prompt, product, and scoring, teachers specify the instructional strategies they will use and how much time they will need to accomplish the mini tasks with students. In this example, the teacher seeks to help students develop active reading strategies to better comprehend the text. That's our skill. The prompt asks students to use annotation techniques, such as highlighting, writing notes, and questions to interact with the text. The product will be the students' notes and annotations on their sources. The teacher could collect these artifacts as a ticket out the door and briefly review them so that instruction can be adjusted the next day as needed. The scoring guide is specific to the mini task. The instructional strategies provide a brief routine for the teacher and make it easy for any teacher to successfully use this LDC module. The pacing provides an estimate of the time needed to complete the mini task. In this instance, students are completing the reading during class over multiple days. After you complete the What Instruction section of your module, Take a moment to reflect on the following guidelines. Mini tasks and scoring guides directly relate to skills lists. Everything is purposeful. Instructional strategies support the mini tasks and move students on the pathway to success on the teaching task. Instructional ladder is realistically paced. Materials and references students and teachers will need to complete the instruction are clear. Creating an LDC module begins with a quality task or assignment. Teachers develop a skills list and a series of mini tasks to address those skills. The skills and mini tasks form an instructional ladder, which the teacher uses to guide students toward success on the task. For more information about LDC and to see sample LDC modules, go to literacydesigncollaborative.org.